knowing the unit weight of concrete is an important step while designing reinforced concrete structures as well as during preparing mix design. The unit weight of unreinforced concrete is different as compared with the weight per cubic foot of a reinforced concrete mass. Similarly, if you're working on a demolition project, you need a dumpster to suit the size depending on the weight of concrete. So, in our today's video, I'm going to explain you in depth about the weight of the concrete. So, why you need to know the weight of concrete? Here are different scenarios in which it is pretty helpful to reckon the weight of the concrete. You're placing pre-cast concrete panels and need to determine the capacity of lifting crane or skid steer loader. You're working on demolition project and have to know the size of the dumpster to put the concrete in properly sized container or the know the correct amount of trucking to remove the broken concrete during demolition. You're designing concrete structure and have to estimate the dead weight of the concrete member. You're pouring concrete at site using crane and need to know the size of bucket to carry the weight of the concrete to the pouring site. Factors affecting weight of concrete. We know concrete is an amalgam or mixture of different constituents. The most common ingredients of concrete include cement, sand, and aggregate. With such, we call this concrete as plain cement concrete or PCC. So, weight or density of concrete depends entirely on the composition or mixture along with the compaction or densification of concrete components. So, we can say the weight of concrete depends on size of the concrete member, type of aggregate, normal or lightweight, type of cementitious material, cement type or slag, type of reinforcement, rebar, fibers, or other types, Compaction or densification, densely packed or loose. Mode of compaction, table vibrator, rotting, or no compaction. A normal concrete weighs about 2,400 kg per cubic meter. So, that means if you're batching a cubic meter of concrete and would be carrying that on a transit mixer, the weight of the concrete is 2,400 kg that is 2.4 tons. The density or unit weight of normal concrete is 2,400 kg slash M3. 150 pounds per cubic foot, while the lightweight concrete weighs about 1,750 kg M3 or 110 pounds per cubic foot per unit. This means that if you take a block having size of 1 foot by 1 foot with height of 1 foot, it will weigh 2,400 kg or 150 pounds. The weight of reinforced cement concrete, RCC, is 2,500 kg M3 that comes around 156 pounds per cubic foot. So, you see due to reinforcement, the weight of concrete is increased. So, let's say you have a driveway that you want to get rid of so you might be interested in knowing how much weight of concrete you're going to toss up from the old concrete driveway? Well, as a rule of thumb we normally take weight of concrete for one cubic yard is about one ton. Now start from measuring the square footage of the concrete driveway. You can divide the driveway in different patches if the area is irregular. You can first determine the length of the driveway and multiply that with the width of the driveway. If your driveway doesn't have any transition or irregular shape, you can determine the length at centerline and multiply that with the width. Once you have the square footage of the concrete, you can multiply that with the density to know the weight of the concrete you're going to be tossing. Please note that the figures I have explained are for density of concrete. The density of different ingredients like cement or aggregate will be different from this value. The density or unit weight of normal Portland cement is 1,440 kg M3 or 94 pounds per cubic foot, pound slash FT3. In laboratory, civil engineers determine the density or unit weight of the concrete as per ASTMC 138 or as per as 1,199. It includes pouring and compacting mass of concrete in a standard jar of known volume. The sample is poured in layers with each layer properly compacted using 25 to 50 strokes each layer. The weight is measured for the concrete and is divided by volume to determine the density of the concrete. So, that's all about our today's video. If you've liked it please hit like button. If you've not yet subscribed please hit subscribe button and share my channel with other civil engineers.